With the Lion's Gate on August the 8th, it brings with it a portal opening to accelerate our ascension. And in this video today, I want to share with you the key things that I think you should know about this Lion's Gate, as well as a powerful light code activation, a Lion's Gate light code activation to help you accelerate your ascension. So the Lion's Gate portal is truly a powerful event because it actually opens, you know, even pre prior to August the 8th, but it really uh, hits the, the high point on August the 8th on the Lion's Gate day, which is August the 8th, and also brings with it the 8-8 energy as well. So it's truly a powerful portal, and it continues a little after the day as well, but it truly hits the high point on August the 8th. But let me share with you those five key things, and then we move into the light language so you can really bring in those light codes that are now available to you. The first thing here is that ascension now really accelerates, where you raise in your consciousness, where you raise in your inner awareness as well. Uh, you may have more insights, you will feel more connected, your gifts may also sharpen even more or develop rather quickly as well, because you're really, if you are tapping into this Alliance Gate energy, you can truly accelerate your ascension. So it's really we're being given that cosmic boost on our ascension journey to really ascend more quickly, to elevate ourselves, our thinking, our feeling, our gifts, our senses, everything. It's really being uplifted so we can really look at also things from a higher perspective, think about things from that higher level of consciousness as well. So it's truly beautiful that we're really being assisted on a cosmic uh, level, on a collective level to ascend. Now, even those who are really not into the whole spiritual, they are receiving that boost as well. They're just probably not aware of what is going on, but every single soul on this planet will be given the, the light codes, the activation to really accelerate their ascension. Now, of course, what each and every person does with it, that's up to them. But if you're consciously really choosing to ascend, you're really getting that extra boost as well to really help you elevate your ascension or accelerate your ascension. And the second thing here is that there's an inner quickening now happening that can be felt where you will feel that life accelerates where you feel like, oh my God, I'm moving forward. Oh my God, this is like so fast right now. So that's really what's happening where things are starting to fall into place, where uh, things are starting to move forward more quickly with more ease. Situations that maybe previously felt kind of stuck and it didn't really want to move or resolve, they also now resolve with more ease. But because there's really that quickening that can be felt uh, on, on all levels, actually. So just be prepared that things start to accelerate now. You will then also feel that maybe you're actually feeling that also, you know, especially around the lion's gate, um, that inner quickening, you may then also feel that your, your mind is racing a little bit more, or maybe you're talking faster, or you're feeling like, like, like the time just passes by so quickly. That's where we're being given that acceleration. So in order to accelerate, things have to, it may be perceived as life accelerates as well, like things just kind of quickening as well. That's like the, the downloads that you're getting, the, the light codes that are being infused within you to really help you ascend more quickly. So don't be surprised if you're feeling a little off during that time too, where you feel like you are just speeding ahead and everything kind of speeds up. That's because of the energies, uh, because of the lion's gate. Then the third piece here is that your soul's plan is now unfolding. Meaning that with this accelerated ascension, your soul now also steps more into the forefront, truly guiding you, leading you, helping you really step into what your soul has come here to do. And also helping you implement the plan that your soul has made before entering this lifetime. And I want to invite you to check out a video. It's, it's called Your Unique Soul's Blueprint, The Roadmap for Your Life, where I talk a little bit more about how you can really tap into your, your own unique soul's blueprint because your soul has a plan. Right? It's not about what you think you should do, but your soul already knows what to do, what is to your highest and greatest good, how you are meant to go about certain things. And by you tapping into your soul's blueprint, it will help you do just that. So I have a video for you to, that where I explain a little bit more about that, but then also I have a challenge where I want to invite you to join me. It's a five-day free challenge 
where I'll walk you through, you know, over a course of five days on how to really connect with your unique soul's blueprint, how to get insights from that, and then how to really take those soul inspired actions that are really in alignment with that soul's blueprint. Link is in the description below, or you can go to unlockyoursoulsblueprint.com and you can join me in a five day challenge. I think you're going to love it. Then the fourth piece here is previously, previously stuck energies are now also moving like situations, energies, anything that felt kind of stuck is now also moving ahead, really assisting you with moving forward. You will also feel more inspired to actually take those soul inspired steps. And then your outer world will then reflect back at you what you're feeling within like that, that inner accelerated ascension, the awakening, that really feeling more empowered, more inspired, more motivated, more courageous. Your outer world will then reflect that back at you. But because things then start moving ahead, like with that quickening that you can feel then also, Things are starting to move ahead as well. Like st anything that was stuck up until this point gets also a bit of a boost to get unstuck. So you can really let it go, move forward and leave it behind. And then the fifth and final piece here is just before we move into light language is that there's also now an inner sense of peace and tranquility that can be felt as well because you're now easing more into this new plan. Your soul is stepping more to, into the forefront. You will then feel that, you know what, I don't have to do this by myself. You know, I, I got, I got this internal support system, this inner GPS that is guiding me, that is leading me. And it's also guiding you into really embracing that new template for your life that accelerated a life template, that life plan for you. So all of that is, is happening and is giving you that inner peace and tranquility that yes, I'm good. Everything is happening to my highest and greatest good. Everything is unfolding beautifully. So these are the five key things that I want you to know about this lion's gate. Now let's move into the light language activation so you can really uh, bring in those energies to accelerate your ascension, awaken even more if you so choose. So if you can please put, put both feet on the ground, get center, take a deep breath in and breathe in light and love, fill your entire body with this loving light. And as you're breathing out, drop into your heart and then close your eyes. Release anything that doesn't need to be here, any doubts, any worries, any to-do lists, let it all go. And just be present in the here and now. We're going to, this activation is going to assist you in releasing whatever is now ready to be released in order to prepare you for this lion's gate portal and, and accelerate ascension that is now available to you. So you may call upon your higher self, your soul, your team of guides to assist you in this, in this activation. Uh, but I also call forth the highest, best, most loving guides, archangels, ascended masters, and beings of the light that can best support us now. Please step forward and connect with us. Please uplift us, prepare us for this Lion's Gate activation. We're now ready, we're now open, we're now receptible for this activation, for this inner awakening that now awaits for us. We ask for divine support to please cleanse our, to please cleanse and clear our four bodies, our emotional, mental, spiritual and physical body, releasing any negative imprints, any stuck energy, any fragments that we have taken on that are not ours all that is now ready and that we're now able to release. Please cut any cords to past lives, past experiences, through all times, dimensions, space and reality, closing the chapter on what has been in order to open ourselves up to the new accelerate path ahead. And please activate within that what is needed to allow the, this accelerated ascension. Awaken this within our being Align us to our soul's highest path as we now open ourselves up to receive the codes, the activations and downloads for our new accelerated and evolved life template. And please help us release any fears, any doubts or worries as we allow this to unfold as it is to our highest good and the highest good of all humanity. And please show us what we are now ready to see. Open our inner spiritual eyes so we may see our path ahead with clear sight and the knowing that this is what is meant to be. 
en sores. Ura hitura anes tu rachtel echta achete enura, en nuku ushtana a itu uraistra a, nuku lakta anekte ushtala ha enura, hella a iru uraastra a, nu uraastra a inara a estu, enakate elurushta ane estust a. Astara a enna akte elura, hesturu uta anne ekte elushta, na alle na estur ukte anne etu, nura na an est ur akte el a inna a astara a inna, tura alakte estuna, asta nestu, hasta estuna akte euta a. Nu urana akte elura a enura a istur ukta a. Nu urana astur a enura a estu ushte ehi. La akte enna akte estura. Ne lakte enu ushte enukra ahane ella ahi. Tara ane est ura a enna a estara a. Nura anekte eshta ena estura. Ella a inna akte estu ura akte a inuta akte estu ushta. Ne tekiti inna a te nekita ane eluru ula kata ane estu. Hae nu uta heta a raitu ura anna a te enna a astara a a. Nukur ane ella a inna ra a inna ra akte ura akte enura astara a inna. Nuda a ranila ane kitu ushtu. Nu ushta a ha ne ehes tu ura a ne kita a inura astra a nu ku ura a ne la a inuru kutu ushta nu ushta na a inara inura a inara astra a ina a ha ala a ena a etu ura a ne elura a ne etu ura a ne stru u nu ura na a enura a hena a itu rust a na a itara a. Now imagine, beloved, there's a pearl of white light right above your crown chakra, moving down, dropping into your crown, and settling into your mental mind, your higher mind, your spiritual mind, the center of your mind, activating within that your higher level of consciousness, opening up your third eye and your crown, activating your inner sight and your inner knowing. Kura kata na kate elura an nekate ella a inura a hitara a inara astra. Nukura an nekate ala a inara a esturu ukta an na e esturu ulla an ne ella a inara a. Nukura a na a ekte e uta a ne e lura a ne e tura a ne est ura a kte e. Nye uta na a tena kte e la a inara a istru uhu. Now imagine seeing a white beam of light coming from up above down into your crown, activating within you the higher knowing infusing within you the divine downloads that you are now ready to receive, which will accelerate your inner awakening, your higher level of consciousness, so you may hear more clearly the guidance from up above, the guidance from spirit, the guidance from your angels, as well as the guidance from your soul, your higher self, the the source that is within, the source that is connected to source itself. Allow us to unfold. Allow yourself to be filled up with these downloads, with this white light that is activating you at the deepest level you are now ready to be activated with. Kura anna kate ella khenne u khanne est ura ed ura anne est ura a ist ennu at kate ennu ta akte est ura a in are etu nu ku ura anna a etur u kate anne est ura uhu nu ura anne la kate elluna atene ekitu ta anne etur u ta a 
Nura anakata ane etur anakata ela ainora ainura ahituru uta ane est ura ane elura ane eta. Nura anakata est ura ane elura anakata ane kte ura ane est ura ata. We now also activate your spiritual sight. And before your mental mind, you are now being given a symbol. Allow the symbol to appear. This may be a certain shape. It may be a color. Or it might be some different image. Allow it to appear before your mental mind. This symbol is your symbol of ascension. This symbol you may choose to meditate upon to assist with your ascension. This symbol is yours. It comes from soul. It is your soul assisting you with this activation by gifting you this symbol. Tara anakate elura anakate elakate ela inura atikte elura anestura ahetu akte ela a inura akte elura akte enura atinakte alena a itura ana ate. Nukul anal anel a le est urauta ane etur anakte anekt ura ane la a inura ahi. Nuura nakata ane est ura na ahed ura ane etura a. We now also activate within your heart, your soul's template, your elevated, accelerated, more awakened soul template for you to embody now at this time. Allow it to be infused or reawaken within your heart center. Kura knekte elane stura ane ekde elust ane heta. Tu kura akte ane lakte elura ane kte estun a esturu uta. Nu uran atekte elura ane stura ane kte ane etur ane elura ane kte ura akte esturu ata. Nukura anes tu ura ana a. We now envelop you with a beautiful white silvery light. This white light around you, this white silvery light around you, will activate your spiritual body, your emotional body, your even your physical body and your spiritual body to ascend, to uplift, to raise in frequency. Kurakta lakta in nai sturakta alakta ala a inura ahi turu ola aha. Allow yourself to be uplifted. Kura anekta elura anela a ist ura ane etur anekta ala nai itura ana astra aha. Nuku unakta ane ela a inura ahte ist ahen ura hate elura anela a inura a estra a. Nurana a ist hur achne ehe. Nastra anest urachne ehe. Atlekit ura na tetekit ulura anne rust an est ud anne ukt uch anne la ist a. Now allow yourself to ground back into the here and now. Ground yourself deeply with your feet on the floor or on the ground, connecting yourself deeply with Mother Earth. Imagine those roots coming out of your feet, reaching down, 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 deep down into the core of Mother Earth, anchoring in this activation, anchoring in this frequency, this uplifted, frequency that you have been just gifted. Ground it back into the here and now. Ground yourself back into the here and now. You may take a deep breath in as you anchor in that what we have just given to you. Anchor it in, welcome it in, allow it to unfold, allow it to continue to assist you with your ascension with your inner awakening. Allow your soul's plan to come into your awareness. That new template that you are now ready to embody, to embrace, 
and to act upon. And so it is, beloved, you now have received this Lion's Gate activation. You may go about your day with an open heart, an open mind, knowing that you have just received this activation and it will continue for as long as you require us to assist you on the spiritual levels to assist you in your ascension. And so it is, beloved. Blessed be. Now you may take another deep breath in and just let it all settle. And then when you're ready, you may open up your eyes again and come back into the here and now. So really hope you enjoyed this activation. And I'm curious to know, did you see that symbol? Did you get some insights into your soul's plan, that new template for your soul? Do me a favor, leave me a comment below. Let me know what was your experience? What happened for you during this activation? I would love to know. And also while you're at it, do me a favor, hit the like button if you like this activation. Maybe even share it with someone that you think it could benefit from hearing that as well. But now let's talk a little more about what can you do to really make the most out of this Lion's Gate activation and the Lion's Gate itself. Now, what I want to invite you to do is write new intentions and also a new story, like a really an elevated story for what you want to call forth, that life that you want to uh, create for yourself moving forward. Because you have been just given that, that activation to really tap into your soul's plan, that new elevated plan for your life. So what you can do is really tune in, get into meditation, really tune in, connect with your soul, and then write based on that. Write your new intentions, write that new story based on what you feel called to do. And also be sure to check out my uh, five day challenge, the Unlock Your Soul's Blueprint five day free challenge where I really guide you on how to really connect with your soul's blueprint and get the insights into what you're here to do and then how to best go about it. It's definitely a powerful five day challenge where you will walk away with insights into what your soul has, uh, has come here to do and how to really go about it. Link is in, in the description below or you can go to unlockyoursoulsblueprint.com and sign up for the free challenge. Now, another thing that I want to invite you to do is meditate. Really tune into this frequency, tune into this energy of the lion's gate and meditate on the frequencies that you have been giving now as well. Or just meditate to really clear your mind, to open yourself up, to receive the insights, the guidance of what next steps you may take moving forward. And ideally, you may want to be out in nature if you can and really connect with Mother Earth. I mean, that's truly the most beneficial thing that you can do is really connect with Mother Earth, connect with that that powerful energy. And of, of course, also the energy of the Lion's Gate portal as well. So if you can be outside and maybe even meditate outside or journal outside, set your intentions outside, it's definitely beneficial. So I really hope you enjoyed this video. Be sure to check out now this next video here about where I talk a little bit more about your unique soul's blueprint to give you some insights into what it is and how you can really tap into that. I think you're going to love it. And I look forward to seeing you again in the next video. Until then, make an amazingly abundant, successful day. Namaste.